What if I tell you that there is a chance of existence of life beyond Earth? Don't believe me? But what if a renowned scientist also believes in this theory? Talking about life in outer space is incomplete without the James Webb Space Telescope, which has once again amazed the scientific community with its latest data on Proxima b, an exoplanet orbiting the red dwarf star Proxima Centauri, our closest stellar neighbor at a mere 4.24 light years away. Since its discovery in 2016, Proxima b has been the subject of intense study. Its unique location within the habitable zone of its star, that is the region where liquid water could potentially exist, makes it the talk of the town. And recently, physicist Michio Kaku has shared his insights on the groundbreaking findings by JWST, shedding some light on the potential habitability of Proxima b and the surprising possibility of artificial light being detected on this alien world. First, let us all know about Proxima b. It is a rocky planet, slightly larger than Earth, with a mass approximately 1.27 times that of our home planet. Orbiting its host star at a distance of 0.05 astronomical units, its proximity to Proxima Centauri places it in the so-called Goldilocks zone, where conditions might be just right for liquid water to exist on its surface. This quality makes it one of the most promising candidates for the search for extraterrestrial life. But this planet is slightly different than Earth. It is tidally locked, which means that one side of the planet permanently faces its star, while the other remains in eternal darkness. Though this feature may seem vague, but it makes this planet a considerable zone for life. With the discovery of James Webb Space Telescope in December 2021, our understanding of the outer space has changed. The telescope has revolutionized our understanding of distant worlds through its advanced infrared imaging capabilities. By analyzing the light spectra from Proxima b as it interacts with its host star, it has provided unprecedented insights into the planet's atmospheric composition, surface conditions, and even potential biosignatures. According to Kaku, the latest findings from the telescope suggest presence of a thin atmosphere composed of carbon dioxide, nitrogen, and traces of oxygen. However, the planet's proximity to Proxima Centauri makes it a matter of slight concern. The impact of stellar flares, which are common in red dwarf stars, could strip away the atmosphere over time or create harsh radiation conditions on the surface. Despite these new and harsh findings, Kaku remains optimistic about the possibility of life on Proxima b. According to Hai, life on Earth has adapted to extreme environments, from the scorching depths of hydrothermal vents to the frozen tundras of Antarctica. So it should not be surprising that a life form could appear or evolve to withstand high levels of radiation or thrive in subterranean environments shielded from stellar flares. The most interesting aspect of the telescope's findings is the detection of unusual light patterns originating from the night side of Proxima b. While these patterns could be some natural phenomenons, such as volcanic activity or auroras, some scientists have speculated that they might be indicative of artificial light sources. Michio Kaku describes this occurrence as a game changer. If the light patterns are actually artificial, they could signify the presence of an advanced civilization capable of producing and utilizing energy on a planetary scale, which itself is a great news and discovery. But being a great scientist, he also advises us to not get our hopes high and wait for the actual factual evidence for the existence of life on Proxima b. He also emphasizes on the fact that confirming the existence of life, whether microbial or intelligent, on Proxima b is no small task. 
One of the main challenges is the vast distance between Earth and Proxima Centauri. At 4.24 light years away, even the fastest spacecraft from Earth would take tens of thousands of years to reach the system. This actually means that any direct means of obtaining evidence is currently not available. So our best hope remains the Space Telescope. Moreover, distinguishing between natural and artificial phenomena requires advanced tools and techniques. For instance, the light patterns observed on Proxima B's night side could be analyzed for periodicity or modulation, which might suggest an artificial origin. Similarly, the chemical composition of the planet's atmosphere could reveal biosignatures, chemical markers associated with biological processes, such as methane or oxygen in specific ratios. The discovery of potential artificial light or biosignatures on Proxima b would have profound implications for humanity. It would confirm that we are not alone in the universe and raise fundamental questions about the nature of life and intelligence. As Kaku explains, such a discovery could revolutionize our understanding of biology, chemistry, and even philosophy. It might also inspire new technologies and strategies for interstellar communication and exploration. Kaku also highlights the potential for such findings to unite humanity in a shared sense of purpose. The search for extraterrestrial life transcends national and cultural boundaries, offering an opportunity for global collaboration in science and technology. The prospect of making contact with an alien civilization, while daunting, could also serve as a catalyst for addressing existential challenges on Earth, such as climate change and resource scarcity. The journey to understanding Proxima b is far from over. The JWST's findings are just the beginning of what promises to be a long and fascinating investigation. Future missions, such as the planned, is Large Ultraviolet Optical Infrared Surveyor Telescope, could provide even more detailed observations of Proxima b and other nearby exoplanets. Additionally, other initiatives like Breakthrough Starshot aim to send tiny, laser-propelled spacecraft to the Proxima Centauri system, potentially providing direct data within a few decades. In the meantime, scientists will continue to analyze the wealth of data provided by JWST using sophisticated models and simulations to interpret the findings. Public interest in Proxima b and the search for extraterrestrial life remains high, driven in part by the compelling narrative of exploring our cosmic neighborhood and the possibility of encountering intelligent life. The latest data from JWST on Proxima b, explained completely by Michio Kaku, represents a significant milestone in our quest to understand the universe and our place within it. From the detection of a thin atmosphere to the tantalizing possibility of artificial light, the findings challenge us to expand our horizons and consider new possibilities. While many questions remain unanswered, one thing is clear. The exploration of Proxima b is not just a scientific mission, but a profound journey of discovery that speaks to the very essence of what it means to be human. So, if you too want to feel the very essence of humanity, do come back to our channel. Also, do tell us your thoughts and opinions in the comments section below.